Hey, Diana, right? Oh, hey, you're Daniela? Yeah, I was wondering if you want to come hang out with me and the others. We're just chilling in my dorm playing video games, since I know you had a lot going on last time. Um, I wish I could, but I have a lot of catching up on work to do. What are you working on? Maybe I could help. Just this paper. I have to research a whole bunch of business models, and it has to be three pages. Oh, girl, you'll be fine. Just BS it, trust me. Who even assigns papers on business anyway? It's supposed to be about math. Where's the math? <laughs> Not that I like math. That's college for you. Papers for everything. Which is why you should take a break and kick it for a few. It'll do you some good. Okay. Hey guys. So you met Ricky and Anna. Hey. Hi. And of course, Lucy. Hey, Diana, come in. Oh, hey. Come on, sit in where you like. Do you drink? Oh, yeah. Ah! Oh, how do I keep losing? Rookie, I told you not to sleep on me. Probably pulled yourself away from all that work, huh? Yeah, yeah, okay. I could have fun too, you know. You ever just wish you could just hop in a car and ride down an empty interstate? No plan, no destination, just the freedom of it. Oh my god, yes! All the time, but since that can't happen, this will do for now. Being in documents is a real bitch. Hey, some friends, some drink, some weed, makes it a little bit more bearable though. Wait, you guys are also... Me and Lucy have DACA. Anna and Ricky are fully undocumented. So believe me, we feel you. I have a car though. I'm usually in my room, so let me know when you want to speed that interstate, and we'll make it happen. Hey now, don't go getting no tickets. You know that comes with hella consequences for us. Hey, you okay? Yeah, sorry. I don't know if it's the beer or all the stress, but it feels nice to be understood around here for once. There is this group therapy session on campus for students like us. Community helps out a lot. Good afternoon, students. Welcome to Business 101. I hope all of you had had an opportunity to look at the syllabus. My expectations will be you'll be on time, on task, and ready to carry the curriculum forward. One of the first things in studying business is understanding supply and demand. I'll be supplying the knowledge that you're going to need moving forward. Those of you not paying attention or taking copious notes will have difficulty in passing this class. Sorry, I thought I put her on silent. Seriously, Diana, do you need to be excused? So to summarize our business model, you can understand that we need to have structure. You need to have discipline. You have to have all your ducks in a row and make sure Everything is taken care of. <sighs> Let 
I hope this doesn't become a pattern, Diane. Hola, mami, estaba en clase. ¿Qué pasó? ¿A quién pararon? ¿En serio? ¿Y en qué clase él está? Ok. Bueno, ajá, yo, yo te ayudo a encontrar una forma, ¿ok? No, sí, yo le llamo, yo le llamo. Ok, bye. Fuck, who do I even call? Is the attorney keeping you in the loop about everything? Yeah, she is. Thank you so much for giving me your contact info, by the way. It helped a lot. Of course. Anytime. How's your mom? She's a lot more calm now. Um, I don't think she'll be completely calm until she gets to see him with her own two eyes, though. Yeah. My mom was the same way when it happened to us. I guess that's just the risk they gotta take every time they drive anywhere. Fuck, I forgot to finish my paper and it's due today. Come on, let's go. You're gonna be late. Um, hi, I'm Anna. Um, came back because I'm still a little stressed with schoolwork and home a bit, but um, this is my friend Diana. Diana? Diana, are you all right? Huh? Oh, sorry, is it my turn? Uh, my name is Diana. I'm a freshman and I am a business major. Good. Any fun fact you'd like to share? <laughs> I guess that my dad got arrested this morning. Sorry, I don't mean to be such a Debbie Downer. I just feel like a fraud. I'm supposed to be here making them proud. And instead, I forget to do a paper. And part of me feels like I shouldn't care, but I can't just follow my dreams and let them down at the same time. I'm supposed to be taking advantage of the scholarship and part of me feels so ungrateful. But it's just hard. I just should appreciate this opportunity more, I guess. We are all here for you. Feeling and expressing your emotions is important. I've always been told the opposite. What's stopping you from dropping business? Everything. My parents. Life. My status. Things don't have to be so black and white, you know. You get to be selfish sometimes. No, I don't think that I do. I'm dropping business. What? Why? It doesn't make me happy. Things that don't make you happy in the long run aren't worth it. Oh, I have to, I have class, I have to go. See y'all later, bye. But 
how do you just take that risk? I don't know. Life is like a bus. It won't wait on you forever. And eventually, you have to make a choice before it takes off. Besides, our life has been full of risks. What's one more? decirte um, no digo bueno te quiero mucho sí, esto, ¿sí? what are you doing out here like a weirdo don't people from Georgia know how to have fun okay bye wait for me <laughs> 